We have another face of Ingham County to introduce you to today. I'm with Doug Duncan and you are a senior at Holt High School. Tell me a little bit about it. What do you love about the school and your experience there? So the people there, you know, both the teachers and the students really make the experience more enjoyable. I find that I've gotten really lucky with most of my teachers throughout not only high school but the whole process. So I feel like that's really helped the experience along. And then like I said, you know, the, the classmates around me have always been really cool and given me people to have in the classroom, so it's made it more enjoyable there too. Are there any extracurricular activities or clubs or groups that you're involved in there that you really like? So I used to be a member of the robotics team, um, and then I'm one of the section leaders in the marching band right now as well. And so I'm involved in the, the basketball team as well, but I work the scoreboard for the games. I'm not a member of the team. So. Oh, great. And what do you do for the marching band? What's your instrument you play? So I play the alto saxophone. Oh, so. great. And what do you love about that? I love that it's allowed me to meet new people. You know, people that I might not have ever met while I was in high school otherwise. You know, people of other grade levels or just people, you know, that I might, might not have ever had any other classes with. So it's the experiences and people it's allowed me to meet, you know. Okay, so you're a senior at Holt. What do you have to pass along to maybe the incoming freshmen next year? Do you have any advice or encouragement that you would want to pass along to them? I would recommend for them to try your best to be open-minded about everything. I feel like, especially with me when I was coming in, I was afraid and didn't really know a lot of people very well, but you know, just allow yourself to get to know other people and really embrace the, the high school life. You know, try to get involved in as many things as you can just to fully experience the high school life, you know? Yeah, there's so much going on there. And mm -hmm. what do you plan to do after you graduate? Well, after I graduate, I'm going to LCC um, and then from then on transferring because I would like to either be a teacher or a school counselor. So something in the, you know, school area to kind of help people along, you know, like I've had earlier, I said I had such good experiences with teachers before. I'd like to, you know, in the future, be able to give that to another era of people and hopefully more than just one, you know. And Doug, you grew up in the Ingham County area and tell me a little bit about your family, your siblings, your parents. So I have one younger brother. I also am a proud father of two cats. Um, so I have, you know, also a mom and a dad. And most of my dad's side of the family lives in town, but most of my mom's side of the family doesn't. And so um, at least within town, you know, I've got a good chunk of relatives here. And, you know, we're pretty much throughout the area. So I get to go to different places when I go to see different people. And, you know, that's always cool. And speaking of seeing places and people, you were saying one of the places you want to see is Disneyland. Have you never been there before? No, I have not. Oh my goodness. So what would you want to go and experience there? Why would that be your place that you would want to go well, and see? Well, my, my two favorite pastimes, I would say, other than playing video games, are watching Marvel and watching Star Wars things. So I would love to be able to experience the, the different sections that they have for those, you know? Like I know at Disneyland, one of them at least, you can go like onto the Millennium Falcon. I think that would be... Mm -hmm. Super cool, kind of a dream come true almost. <laughs> hey, maybe graduation present, Mom. <laughs> Mom, if you're watching, <laughs> graduation present. All right. Well, we're talking about, you know, the Ingham County area being your home. If you are thinking of the word home, is there like a word or phrase that comes to mind when you think of that word home? I would say safe, you know, reliable. I feel like home is a place that I like to be and that a place that I can feel truly that, you know, everything is okay in, you know, with how chaotic the world has kind of been lately, I didn't really have anywhere else to go. So just being home, you know, and being able to, to really, you know, process everything and all that. So yeah, in a safe space. All right, Doug, well, I've really appreciated getting to know